Recording in WebEx is really easy. First, start your meeting, and when you're ready to record, move your mouse to the bottom of your screen and find the recording icon. It's the circle icon that looks like a bullseye. You'll click that recording icon and then click record. Remember, it's a best practice to let all of your participants know that you're going to record the session before you actually start recording. Once you do click record, a little red icon will appear at the top of your screen, letting you know that the session is being recorded. During your recording, you have two options. You can pause or you can stop. If you stop recording, it stops the recording and creates a file. If you pause, it simply pauses the recording and allows you to resume and add to that recording file. Once you stop your recording and finish your meeting, your recording will show up in your WebEx dashboard. Now that you've finished your WebEx meeting, you want to return to your dashboard and click Recordings on the left-hand side of your screen. This takes you to a page of all of your recorded meetings. Notice that my top meeting is still generating the recording. The WebEx servers can get busy, and it can take longer than usual for the recording to be created. But WebEx will send you an email when that recording is ready to be downloaded. When your recording's ready, Find the download icon, the arrow pointing down, and click on it to download that video. Pay close attention to the size and duration of your videos. If they're extremely long and extremely large in size, it could take a long time for them to download, and then also a long time for you to be able to upload to another site. You might wanna consider batching your recordings. That means during your meeting, using the stop button so that you're creating many recording files throughout the meeting. And then you can download each file separate and upload each file separate.